So you're tired of Minecraft looking really bad. You have a good computer, but Minecraft is looking like you're playing it on the phone. Don't worry, because today I'm going to show you how to install Optifine 1.18.2, which is not only going to let you add shaders so Minecraft could look beautiful, but it's also going to let you customize Minecraft so it could run smoother. Welcome to It's Cuba Tutorials, and let's get started. First up, number one, you're going to like this video and subscribe to the channel. I'm just kidding. First up, number one, we're going to click the first link in the description, which will bring you to this website called java.com downloads. In here, we're going to download Java, which is the app that is going to let us install Optifine. Go ahead and click agree and start download for free. Don't worry, this is completely safe. Java has been around longer than we have been around. As you can see, the download is down here on the left. Go ahead and open it. You should get something similar to what I got, unless it has been updated. Go ahead and click install. This is what the installer looks like. It should take around a minute. As you can see, for mine, it says that it detected an older version because I already had Java installed. So I'm just gonna go ahead and delete that one. Yours should look something like this. You have successfully installed Java. Now we could go ahead and close Java and we could go ahead and close this website that we had opened. And now we're going to click the second link in in the description of this video, which will bring you to a website called Optifine.net Downloads. In here, we're going to download Optifine, by far the best mod for Minecraft. When you come to this website, it might have been updated and you might not see 1.18.2 as the first one to come up. So what you're going to do in case you don't see 1.18.2 is click show all version and find the version that you're installing Optifine for. In our case, we're installing 1.18.2, so we could go ahead and click download. After you click download, it will bring you to this website. Do not click anything here and just wait five to 10 seconds, okay? As you can see in the top right corner, it says, please wait. After it has loaded, you're going to click skip, which is going to bring you to this website where you could finally download Optifine. Don't worry, I know it might get a little bit complicated, but it's really simple. Just click download here and that's it. That's it, do not click anything else. Just wait for Optifine to finish downloading. Once Optifine has finished downloaded, you could go ahead and drop it to your desktop, which is a exactly what I'm going to do. Just drop it right here and we can finally close all browsers. Now we're going to open our Minecraft launcher as you can see right here and we're going to make sure that we run the version of Minecraft that we are installing Optifine for at least once. Therefore, since we are installing Optifine 1.18.2, as you can see down here, I'm going to click play once just so Minecraft could load up. Just because you downloaded Optifine already, it doesn't mean that it's already installed, but we do have to run Minecraft at least once before installing Optifine, otherwise it won't work. As you can see, it already opened it. You could go ahead and close it. It just needs to open once. I'm gonna let it fully load just in case. You know, there you go. We could go ahead and quit the game. And only after running the game at least once in your computer, we could install the Optifine that we downloaded. Go ahead and double click it. Here, you can select the destination where we are installing it. Now, since I installed my Minecraft in the default folder, that's where I'm going to install Optifine as well, in the default folder. So just click install. And for me, right away, it said Optifine is successfully installed. So just click OK. It should close everything. Now we're ready to launch Minecraft Launcher again. Go ahead and launch your Minecraft Launcher again. And if you click in this little arrow down here, you can see Optifine 1.18.2 has been successful install. Now, some of you might be saying, Cuba, I don't have Optifine showing down there. What did I do wrong? Wait, before you think you did something wrong, go ahead and click installations and make sure that you have modded selected because if you don't select modded, as you can see, Optifine 1.18.2 does not show. Therefore, we must make sure that modded is selected so we could see it back here. For some of you, Optifine might not even show even if you click modded. What you need to do to fix that is click new installation. You can name this whatever. I name mine subscribe. And now to make sure Optifine shows, we're going to click right here and we're going to find Optifine 1.18.2. As you can see, mine shows right here, but yours could be all the way to the end, so just scroll down until you find it. Then click on the Optifine 1.18.2, which is the one we're installing, and click Create. And as you can see down here where it says Subscribe, 1.18.2 Optifine has been installed. Anyways, we're going to go back to Play, and we're going to assume that you got Optifine right away, so you could click Play. After you click Play, you're gonna get this warning. I know, everybody hates it. It's not my fault. Everybody's gonna get it. It's pretty much Minecraft letting you know that you are running modded Minecraft and that anything could go wrong. Don't worry about it. It's completely safe. Just click that you understand all the risks and that you don't want to be warned again about this installation and then you could click play as you can see when minecraft launched 1.18.2 it says modded right next to it in the bottom left corner to prove to you that you have installed optifine you're going to click options and then you're going to click video settings and as you can see this menu should look different than regular minecraft and we have a new option which is the shaders if you want to learn how to install shaders make sure to subscribe to the channel because that video is coming up soon and we're going to have a bunch of tutorials and right here guys you're welcome to play around with the settings to get minecraft to run better for you. However, that is the end of today's tutorial. I hope you guys were able to install Optifine and that everything runs good for you. Don't forget to subscribe, leave a like, a comment for the algorithm, and tell me what videos you would like to see. Do you want to see more tutorials? You could also follow me on my gaming channel. It's Cuba Gaming, and it's also in the description of this video. If you like the way I talk to the camera, the way I do my videos, then you probably enjoy the way I play games as well. Don't forget to subscribe there because I will start posting videos soon. I have a couple videos ready and they're good. Thank you for watching, and as I always say, bye bye.